One man died and five others were hurt in a rollover crash on I-90 this afternoon that shut down the highway in both directions. King 5's Alyssa Hahn joins us live from Harborview with updated information on the accident. Alyssa. Dennis, it was a horrible accident. All six men were ejected from one car. The five survivors all transported here to Harborview. Two of them were in such bad shape they had to be airlifted from the scene. Now, the accident happened on westbound I-90, just a few miles west of the summit. The driver of a red Mercury Villager minivan lost control, and it rolled several times, throwing him and his five passengers all from the car. We're told all of them are from Somalia, and troopers say amazingly, not one of them was wearing a seatbelt. It's, it's, it's really a shame. Um, we try really aggressively to make sure people wear their seatbelts properly. And in this case, uh, the six were not. Uh, all six were ejected out of the vehicle. The driver was, uh, who we believe to be the driver, was this uh, killed in the crash. The man who died at the scene was a 47-year-old from Seattle. The surviving passengers range from 19 to 35 years old. Three are from Seattle, one from Kent, and the other is from Spokane. So far, Harborview has not released any updates on any of their conditions. Reporting live at Harborview Medical Center, Alyssa Hahn, King 5 News.